Mr. Speaker, I'm honoured today to pay tribute to Mr. Bob Porter, who passed away last week in Medicine Hat. Mr. Porter was a rancher, a community leader, a family man and a member of Parliament from 1984 to 1993. He never sought fame or headlines, but didn't shy away from speaking truth to power or standing up for his constituents. Bob came from a pioneer family that settled in southern Alberta in 1883. They took the reins of the family ranch at 18 and built a strong business as committed and dedicated stewards of the land. Bob focused on strengthening his community through volunteering with the kinsmen, his church, the stampede board, the stock growers, cattle commission, press council, community foundation, and many, many others. Despite how busy he was, he always made time for family. Bob was a strong voice for farmers, speaking his mind, voting his conscience, and pushing for common sense changes. He fought U.S. trade barriers, he stood up for law-abiding gun owners, and he always put the safety of Canadians first. He was a friend who offered encouragement and guidance to me as a new MP. May we all aspire to make Canada better and leave a legacy like that of Mr. Bob Porter. I join with my wife, my community, my riding, and my colleagues in sending thoughts and prayers to Bob's family. This country could certainly use more of Mr. Bob Porter's. Here he is.